Hello, all my beautiful neighbors. Welcome to On Brit's Block. I am Brit. As you come in, please like the video. Help me to get the algorithm. What more people have able to see my video. Also, if you have not hit the little red button over there, go ahead that red button and say subscribe. And tell your neighbors and friends and family to come on over to Brit's Block and find out what's going on. And also, make sure you turn your notification bell so that whenever I upload a new video, you'll be informed. Y'all, it's been a few days since I did a video, and I'm sorry for that. I kind of got discouraged, let me be honest with you, because I'm stuck at 7, 16, and watch hours and trying to get monetized. I know it don't happen overnight, but, you know, I said, you know, I got to work to get to where I got to get to. So make sure you tell your family and friends to come on over to Bridge Block and subscribe. But anyway, yesterday looked like Martel and Marceau wanted to take to IG and do the, some videos so we're gonna first get into this little video with Martel and Ralph Drew Sedora husband off of Roa Real Housewives of Atlanta two of the biggest 304s out here we already know that Drew and Ralph are not together anymore neither, neither is Martel and Melanie but yet still they want to keep throwing up the wives names and their little idea of they're supposed to be doing a fundraiser, golf fundraiser for Miguel. I don't know why he keep wanting to put Martel in something. Martel need to be a fundraiser for himself, raising money for himself, not out here in this hot sun for somebody else. He need to be getting some money raised for him and his little uh, coleslaw and miles to. Tasmanian devil. Whoever the little boy wanna be over there. He need to raise money for himself, not nobody else. But let's get into this. Hey, hey, watch, watch this dude right here, man. He went into the pro shop, went and bought new clothes. <laughs> <laughs> he went to the whole <laughs> changed the whole fit. Got the flowers on now. <laughs> oh, come on, man. Got the new hat. Hell at him, yo. I'm back. Now Rob said that Martel went and bought this outfit out of the store for the golfing do you always buy your clothes too little is that why you always look like that trying to look like your muscle man but no it's the fact that you buy your clothes two or three sizes too small and you can go ahead and buy this little flowery shirt martel want to be this muscle man so bad boy buy buy, buy some bigger clothes that's what you need to do stop shopping out a baby girl let's keep going Yo, we had a great Memorial Day. We was out there cooking, matter of fact, you know what I'm saying? Who was we? Me. I was out there cooking for the kids, you know what I'm saying? You said, you said we. Call me daddy in the kitchen, baby. You said we. Bro, we was cooking. Who, you and who? <laughs> who did the side? You didn't do the side, so who did the side? No, 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 so, no. so, so, typically, when I barbecue, my woman to do the size. So who did the size with you over there? Size for you? No, no, I didn't. I didn't cook now. I ordered. The, I brought the sides in. I did all the meat and everything like that, Paul. And you know, we made it happen. Oh, the kids ate amazing. Oh, did you enjoy? And, and did you enjoy? Bro, I, I really, I really throw down. I, I like. I do this. I, I, I think. I'm probably one of the best male cooks out here. I don't know. It, it's about forty people. Like we gotta go. We gotta see about that. Did you um? Did you and Drew enjoy? Man, bro, you see me trying to hit this boy. No, I'm saying, I'm saying that did Joy, I mean, did Drew enjoy? You and Melody went swimming together. Both <laughs> <laughs> put on your bathing suits. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm good. I'm good. Yeah, you cooked alone. <laughs> you cooked alone. I don't know why you playing, man. Now they should be out here playing golf. They too worried about women that don't even want them have given them their freedom papers. And they still up here, Martel and Ralph, talking about Melanie, Andrew, Sedora. They don't even want them. Just play your game and leave the women out of it. Some people being negative, <clears throat> listen, I tell y'all, y'all people, y'all better stop being so negative. That's it. I haven't read no, um, any negative comments, but <clears throat> if y'all being negative at this point, there's something wrong with y'all, to be real about it. There's something wrong with you in your life that you need to seek help for, for real, though. Okay, Pot, trying to call the kettle black. How you talking about somebody being negative and they need to seek help when they trying to get you to seek help and you won't even go? So when you go to seek help, let us know, then we'll go seek help 
for being negative and telling the truth all at the same time. Because honestly, this is me every single day. Even when things are going wrong, I'm still smiling, I'm still happy, I'm still, you know, I'm really unbothered for real about things. So y'all be happy, stop being negative. Got something going on in your life, go do something to make you happy. Seriously. Seriously. And please, nobody ever say I feel sorry for Martel. Please don't, because my life is amazing. <clears throat> Got my kids, good health, my mom is good. My mom, I, huh? I, take, I, I send my mama places, we go on trips together, trips with my children, making money. It's like, wait, 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 don't wait, feel wait. sorry for me. You right, Martel, saying don't nobody feel sorry for you, because we don't feel sorry for you. Because everything you have done, you have made it your business to harass somebody. So those are the choices you made. So we don't feel sorry for you. And money, where your money at? Because we should, we still trying to find it. You just like everybody else around there. You get making money off the back of Melody. It ain't no really no Martell and Melody started this show because we know who the brains of everything it is. And then you talking about you taking your kids, your mom on vacation. What about Slow? She want to go on vacation, but we already see that you don't really consider her as family. But anyway, y'all, on to the next. It's about, about 150 degrees out here. Ain't no need for complaining, because you're going to mess around and find out that hell is hotter than that. I don't want to hear it. I, I do not want to hear it. Come on. I love the compacts. Hey, I don't want to hear it. Let's see. We go, we go, we go let my people, the hopes. My people are hosting me on out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. Hey, hey, people say you need to give your people names. Like the hell, do me and do that? Don't nobody want to be no hoe. Ain't no power in your name. Melanie even gave you your name back. What make you think we gonna want it? I'm like Melanie. I got divorced before she did. But one thing I asked back for was my name. Because there ain't no power in his name. And he didn't mean me any good. I returned to Cinder. So we returning the hopes back to the Sunday, Martel Hotel Hoax. Whoever is the furthest away got to call their ex and say, I love you. <laughs> Did y'all just hear what he just said? I'm, no, 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 no. Because I got some sad say, say it again, Ralph. So, look, this is what we're going to do. Whoever is the furthest away from the hole got to go and call their ex. You got to call her Melody and say, I love you. Now, we see Ralph is not his true friend. He's trying to get Martel ass locked up, but he wish he would, could call her and say, and say I love you, boy. I'm telling you, this boy right here probably pissed off right now, cause he wanna tell her he love her. Ref is not your true friend. I know how y'all can stay together. Get off TV. Ooh, are you willing to get off TV? I'm are willing, you willing, of course, of course. Oh, you wanna do it right now? Uh, right now. Call Melody right now. Oh, bro. <laughs> now I do not know why Martel think it's the show that is making him. Cause him lose his family. No, you was cheating on Melanie before the show. When you got on the show, you were still che cheating, and she gave you a few chances to get it right, and you didn't. So it's not the show fault, it's your fault. And then even with Ralph, just like his cousin Courtney, you got destiny. So we not for sure what y'all been doing. So the shows are not causing y'all to lose your marriages. It's what you're doing with outside women, outside your marriage, is what's causing you to lose it. So, miss me with all that. It's the show stuff. All the month of June, every every day, acknowledge a man, acknowledge a father, you know what I'm saying, somebody that's critical in your lives, in your kids' life, anybody, you know what I'm saying? Let's go and make that thing happen, yo. Stop playing. No taking, Ralph, but we will not be honoring you or Martell for the month of June, especially not Martell and the things that he have done to his kids and are doing now, allegedly, in my opinion. So the month of June will not be dedicated to him. But anyway, y'all, that's all I got for them. Let's get into this with Maurice, Marceau, excuse me, Bob the Builder, out here building this house, he say. They don't want to deal with homeowners, right? But, and these must go up fast, fast, fast. And we got some other stuff, man. I want y'all to see this right here. All right? Always do something you're proud of. Check this out. Quick question. Now, if you got a company truck 
Why are you not in it? Because we know, I know at least, that cannot be the inside of a scope truck because it's too nice to be inside of a work truck. On with the next. Yeah, in Huntsville, North Huntsville. Well, this is going to be gorgeous. So happy for you and Tisha. Appreciate it. Good building takes time. These go a little faster than commercial. Have you started your own house yet? Have you started yours mine? All right. I think you worry about the wrong thing. I think you better worry about the wrong thing. But yes, I have, by the way. I have. Sorry, a couple years ago. I can't stand Leaky Booty. He got a slick ass mouth like the slick stuff that's leaking out his booty. Now, if you don't want to ask no questions, I haven't but ask you the question, get off live. Or stop reading the comments. Because you being smart for no reason. They just ask you, have you started your house yet? Have you started yours yet? Then you're going to say, you started yours a few, few years ago already, your house. Now, you just said, it don't take that long to build a house that they go up fast. So why your house not done? Because right now, y'all live in the Airbnb. But you want to have a slick mouth, leaky booty. On to the next. I can't stand him. Has a harness on. Definitely has a harness. Because, of course, you got to be safe. So... Definitely has a harness. Um, in case any millimeters saw that. Now, what did the millimeters have to do with the man with the harness? Did any of us ask him or did we even care? You so busy, always worried about the millimeters and what Melanie doing. I know her is about to itch off her body because y'all always got her, got her name in your mouth. It don't make no sense. You talk about the millimeters because the man is on the harness. That's good. DC being safe, you dummy. Them turkey legs was the deliciousest turkey legs I've ever had in my life. They were deliciouser than... What is deliciousest and deliciouser? See, I'm not talking about nobody kids, but I'm about to think that Marceau and Tisha kids probably can't talk because their mama and their daddy and grandma. It's a sad day in Alabama school systems down there. On to the next. Marceau, I'm a commercial... Bro, listen, I ain't saying you got to get my name right. And, and, and the fact that you're an executive commercial lender, I'm mess with you, but Keith, I'm famous now, man. Can you spell my name right? All right. Marisol, I'm an executive for a commercial lender, and we have funding for builders. We're black on reach out. Oh, Keith, uh, I apologize for what I just said. Now, that slick ass mouth almost or should have, because if I was Keith, I would no longer want to work with Marceau because he didn't get his name right. But who told him he was famous? Somebody please tell me who said he was famous. Now because you own a reality show does not make you famous. Especially not for building. Now if you want to say going and having lawsuits for building people um, business wrong like with Zen Garden. That you famous? Yeah you famous for lawsuits. But you are not famous bro. So quit trying to be rude to people about your name because you think you famous. Y'all, Marceau is a piece of work. Martel is a piece of work. These two men just think so highly of themselves when they ain't nobody at the end of the day. And I wish that Melody and the Melamita names can just stay out of their mouth. Just give them a rest. You know, we tired of running in and out your mouth every time you talk and in your thoughts. Give it a rest. Y'all, but that's all I got for you. These two men right here are a piece of work. Oh, and let's not forget Ralph, the other 304 in the bunch. But that's all I got for you. Like, comment, and subscribe. And you already know to do. Have a great day on purpose. She got the news, the stories. Come over here, no worries. If you're looking for the hot topic.